the social game obviously messes with your mind because you just are paranoid most of the time physical in the point of trying to catch food and work around camp that is very hard especially when you are undernourished and not eating it makes it not that fun at all i think the first three days i completely enjoyed because it hadn't quite hit me yet that i was actually on survivor um i'm not sitting on my couch watching it i'm actually on the beach doing it um so that was damn awesome my alliance was with most of all Alison. Myself and Alison made a promise to each other that up until the merge, we would not write each other's names down. Um, and if we heard anyone talking about either one of us, we would let the other person know. Simon, I sort of trusted because he was from the tribe that I started with. The only person basically we had to turn was MXO. It was a game for everyone and you know I was able to score goals for my team. I mean I scored a winning goal which led us to win an immunity idol for the first time. So that was an emotional one for me and what a great feeling. I think the most thing that I missed was food. The thing that was constantly on your mind was food. Um, and I think that's exactly what everyone missed the most. Like you thought you'd miss other stuff. That stuff didn't happen. <laughs> <laughs> We're thinking about food. <laughs> the only person that really pushed my buttons was Vanessa. Um, apparently she's some big celebrity that was in District 9. I didn't even watch District 9, so I really didn't know this poor girl who just wanted to be so known. Like she wants to take the shine. Wow, the blind side that happened with Roxy having the individual immunity was quite a shocker. However, I did, was not aware that we had a clue on individual immunity on our island. Um, Vanessa and Roxy, yeah, I tried to swing Roxy a few times, but she just looked like Vanessa's little puppy dog. She was just following around that island. If we had a leash, wow, well, that could have been like Paris Hilton and a little pooch. I didn't know that Roxy would be that loyal to her. But clearly, they say, you know, a dog is a man's best friend. When I saw my name written down once, I knew that it was gone for me. It was a blind sight that no one saw coming, but damn good one as well. To the remaining survivors out there, I'd like to say, take them to live out. Basically, I'm glad um, that I got out the way I did and that my lions stuck together. I just wish them all the best of luck.